Hello everyone, I'm that one can. Welcome back to another drawing video. Today we're gonna be drawing Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, because, you know, maybe maybe if you live under a rock, you haven't seen the Sonic the Hedgehog trailer, and uh, that's good for you. <laughs> Cause uh, it it was awful. Um, I'm a huge Sonic fan. I mean, growing up, Sonic the Hedgehog 2 was like one of the only games I had, so I played the hell out of it. Um, so I love Sonic the Hedgehog. Like I love the old style. I like the little cute hedgehog guy, you know? Um, I don't really like the new tall, whoa, <laughs> like I don't like that Sonic, the chili dog Sonic. Um, but you know, I, it's, it's okay, I guess. Some people like it, but uh, the new movie that they're coming out with, if you if you're one of the few people who haven't seen the trailer, uh, the new version that they're coming out with is like, it just looks like a child in a suit. It doesn't look like a hedgehog at all. It doesn't even look like a like a cartoon character. It just looks like this terrifying child. So I decided uh, during one of my streams on the YouTubes to uh, to draw my version of Sonic. So this is basically um, a screenshot from the trailer. I'll probably put it up on the screen really quick. The nightmare fuel that you've probably seen on Twitter. And uh, I wanted to draw my own version and see if I could push the limits and make it even more nightmarish. Um, so yeah, this is what I'm drawing for you right now. Uh, this creepy ass looking, whoa! Oh, we got an L in play here. Uh, I think I drew that because someone came into my stream and told me to draw a sexy L for some reason. So I, 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 I like to please my fans, so, <laughs> so I drew a sexy L. Um, so yeah, I drew this during one of my sh what is this? Oh, okay. All right, thick, thick thighs, save lives. All right, cool. Um, so yeah, if you want to see this uh, ridiculousness live, you can check out some of my live streams. And I, I draw some of these things sometimes, and uh, I sometimes do a little doodles on the side. But anyway, back to Sonic. Um, it, it's I'm conflicted because I feel like I, I like Sonic's voice in the movie. I don't I don't really know what that voice. I don't really know that voice actor. I don't know what else he's done. Um, I, I should look it up, but <laughs> um, I like his voice. I think his voice actually sounds good. I mean, I don't like Sonic having a voice in the first place because he, he never had a voice in the original games, and I kind of liked that. He just had, like, an attitude, you know? Like, you kind of just got the gist from his expression, you know? Um, but I like his voice. I, I like the voice that they've chosen for the movie. It's not stupid. It's not, like... You know, whoo, whoa, like that voice. I mean, if you've seen like the newer Sonics, you know what I'm talking about. Um, and of course, oh my God, Jim Carrey. Like I thought Jim Carrey nailed it. Like I, I love Jim Carrey. I, I like the character of Robotnik. And I think he does a really good job at having like sort of like that zany kind of like unhinged genius kind of thing going on. Um, so I'm interested to see. I'm excited to see the interaction between Robotnik and Sonic. Um, and I'm really interested interested to see like how that plays out. Um, so that's what makes me so conflicted because I feel like it looks like it could be a really good movie, and uh, it's just the only thing that's kind of killing it for me is the f the face, you know, like and it just Sonic the way Sonic looks, um, just like looks really stupid. <laughs> and, like his proportions are weird. His hands are really small. His teeth. He has like human teeth. What the hell were they thinking? Like he doesn't have like animal teeth. He has human teeth. So like maybe, I don't know, maybe the story is about like a kid that gets turned into this creature. If that's the case, then I can kind of understand that, but it's still stupid as hell. Um, at the point of uh, making this video though, uh, this was after I drew this, but I saw a tweet saying that the guy, I don't know who he is. Jim Fowler, I think he is. Um, I don't know if he's like the head of Sega in America or something. I have no idea. I don't know anybody. <laughs> um, so uh, it said that he is taking in all the criticism, all the backlash, and he is going to improve. Him and his team are going to improve the way Sonic looks. Um, they're going to change him to make him look, you know, like Sonic. <laughs> they're going to make him look like uh, the character that the movie is titled after. So that that's really cool though. So I'm hoping that's true. I'm hoping that they really do make it look better because like some of the jokes in the in the trailer actually kind of made me laugh. Like when he had him in the duffel bag and he's like, "Oh no, it's a kid, but it's not my kid." Like I don't know. It just it seemed kind of funny to me. Maybe I'm just too optimistic. I don't know. And then, and then when he said "meow," that that was kind of funny. It's just like his face didn't reflect the joke. You know, like his face. If his face looked more cartoony, that would have been pretty funny. Cause like you know he's. Weird ass animal in his house. It's kind of funny if he 
tries to pretend to be a cat or something. But um, I think the movie has potential. It's just Sonic looks like pure nightmare fuel. So if they can just change that, I think it might be an, an okay movie. And it sucks because like Detective Detective Pikachu looks amazing, you know. And that's coming out around the same. Or I think that's coming out pretty soon. So it's weird to see like a game adaptation that looks so good and reflects the character so well next to something like Sonic where it's just like, oh, Jesus Christ. Um, but I'm excited for it. And uh, I also heard a rumor that they purposely made the trailer look bad to spark um, the viralness of it. Like the same thing they, they did with the genie is they made the genie in the movie in the trailer look horrifying so that it kind of got everyone talking about it. I don't know if that's true because then eventually because then they were going to fix it. Like the trailer was purposely made poorly to spark you know people talking about it and get it trending um and then they were gonna fix it when the movie comes out i don't know if that's true um i saw a couple things i read it about it so i don't know but here we go i made a little impressionistic uh background for sonic because i didn't want to just do like a solid color uh, so i put a little little uh, nice background in there it looks pretty cool i actually like how this looks um even though it's terrifying um i hope it becomes a meme so uh, don't forget to share it everywhere, like the plague. <laughs> um, just don't cover up my watermark like a jerk. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys like this. Um, if you want to support me, you can sponsor me now. You can join the channel and uh, get some cool badges and icons and emoticons and all that cool stuff. And uh, yeah, think about doing that. You can also get some behind the scenes that only the members get to see, so you can see this horrifying stuff <laughs> you can prepare yourself before uh, this horrifying stuff you know comes out to public but um yeah check out my art on deviantart and instagram if you'd like to support me please think about being a sponsor on the channel just click that little join button and uh you can also check out my reddit at r slash that one cat and yeah that's about it if there's anything else you guys want to see me draw any memes just let me know and uh yeah i'll see you guys next time hopefully sonic is good. I hope it's good. I'm hoping it'll be good. But uh, yeah, enjoy this. <laughs> enjoy this beautiful thing I made for you. But uh, I'll see you guys next time and have a good day.